I received word that Dr. Lee is returning to us. How cooperative do you think she'll be? Will she be harmed if she... Absolutely not. We have big plans for Dr. Lee. Including the resurrection of one of her greatest... The last thing we'd want to do is kill... As soon as Dr. Lee arrives, we'll interrogate her aboard the Pridwin. She's been under the Institute's influence for the last decade. Uh -huh. Now, on to other matters. Thanks to the success of your reconnaissance efforts, it's time to advance our operations to the next phase. I want you to report to Proctor Ingram at the airport. She has a special project that requires your immediate attention. Once again, Knight, you don't fail to impress. Liberty primed. My long sixty minute man. Oh, yeah. I'm proud to be serving under Elder Maxon. I had enough of lions in his foolish ways. I love lions. Shut up. I bet you're eager to get your hands dirty on our new project. How much has Maxon told you about it? Why all the secrecy? We're pouring every resource we have into this thing. We can't risk tip uh -huh. for now. The fewer people... Come on. It's this way. Unless you're blind as a bat, I'm sure you've noticed that we've been building a gantry on the tarmac. Maxon and Kells have been looking for something that'll tip the balance when we go toe-to-toe -to -toe with the Institute. Now, the Pridwin might be a big beast, but she's not built for fighting. That's where <laughs> our new project comes in. You know, I'm fluent in uncooperative old machine. This storage bay full of parts look? is what's left of Liberty Prime. The Brotherhood used it in the Capital Wasteland as a weapon against the Enclave. It's the most advanced robot the Brotherhood has ever had at its disposal. Unfortunately, Liberty Prime was destroyed in the line of duty. I've spent the better part of the last few years piecing him back together. And if you think that was easy, try rebuilding a Protectron while you're blindfolded. In order to get Liberty Prime fully operational, we're going to need your help. No problem. I'm sure this only looks worse than it actually is. <laughs> I wish I had your confidence, because this is not going to be easy. Now, the good news is that we've got most of Prime's parts fully assembled. The bad news is that it's going to take more than a few rivets and some spot welding to get them working again. The first problem is his CPU. It's fragile, and every time we try to feed power to it, it blows itself out. Why is the power blowing out his CPU? Liberty Prime has a highly complex power system. A good deal of that system was damaged when he exploded. So I'm working in the dark trying to come up with parts on my own. Luckily, you were able to convince Dr. Madison Lee to return to the Brotherhood. She was on the original build team for Liberty Prime a little over a decade ago. I've already spoken to her, but she's reluctant to work on Prime for some reason. If you could get her down here to lend a hand with his power system, we can get the big guy moving. Hmm. Why do these objects keep moving? I forget. There's music. Do you do you know someone who gambles? Then maybe this will make you laugh. Or <laughs>
back in my day. If we want to win the people's hearts, you keep your pets sent to spread the word of the brotherhood across the Commonwealth. I have some special mod. Sort of a hobby I have to pass the time. Sure. Slap a few of them onto your weapons, and I... I'll take a look. All of my... Uh-huh. brings you to me today. If you're here to talk me into working on Liberty Prime, you can forget it. What changed your mind? Nothing changed my mind. I promised you I'd return to the Brotherhood, and I've kept... Do I need to remind you? No, that won't be necessary. Tell Proctor Ingram to get her scribes ready. It's going to take a hell of a lot of work to get Liberty Prime back online. Uh-huh. We should stock up on supplies before we begin our next mission. What's on your mind, soldier? Paladin Dance. Ready to continue our mission, soldier? Ready. Roger that. Dance. Valentine. Cade won't clear me for duty yet. <laughs> I think he's giving me orders. How can a machine believe it's alive? It's ridiculous. <laughs> I'm just gonna Man, leave that there. You haven't lived until you've tipped a Brahmin with a vertebrate. Now that's a challenge. This rust bucket. Oh, sure, the Pridlin's a fine ship, but put me in the field any day. Joining our cause was the wisest decision of your life, brother. Have you collected any blood samples, Knight? Yes, here you go. Excellent. This will help quite a bit. Here's some caps for the trouble. I really appreciate you, sir. As soon as I make a breakthrough.
Dr. Ingram. Well, things are off to a good start. Isn't that right, Doctor? I hope so. Prime suffered some significant damage to his memory core. I wish your people would have been a bit more careful, Proctor. The good news is that the damage isn't irreversible, and I should be able to get the power flowing into his CPU core without overloading. If your people stay out of my way, that is. Mm, charming, isn't she? Sorry about that. Don't worry about it. We might be butting heads on a few issues, but I've dealt with worse. Besides, Dr. Lee's worth all the aggravation. We're working with one of Prime's original designers. I don't see it getting any better than that. In fact, since things are going so well, we're gonna have you start building as electromagnetic actuators. Sure, anything you need. That's what I love about you. You're ready to leap into action, and I bet you don't have the faintest idea what I'm... The actuators are what allows Liberty Prime's arms and legs <laughs> to move. Prime's new lens are way too heavy for the simple hydraulic pistons he had in the past. We're gonna have to rip those out, construct a brand new system using electromagnets, and install them in its lens. What we need you to do is build the actuators for us. Now that you know what the actuators are, you need to know how to make them. These are the plans and the materials list. Don't lose them. Now before you get that look on your face, you'll be happy to know that we have plenty of the raw materials on that list right here at the airport. The only thing we need you to head out and find is a high-powered magnet. According to Proctor Quinlan, the best place to find one is in any of the ruined hospitals around the Commonwealth. We've already sent out a few teams to find the rest of the high-powered magnets you'll need. They should be back by the time you return. Once you start building the actuators, we need one for each limb, so you'll need to make a total of four. Good luck. Well, uh, maybe it's not just... Sounds kind of crazy, if you ask me. And if it were real, it'd be super dangerous, I bet. Sam, fire.
Bongo, 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 I don't want to leave the Congo. No, 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 no. Bingo, bango, bongo, I'm so happy in the jungle. I refuse to go. Facilities like this were funded by privately owned corporations. More interested in making a profit than helping mankind. No matter how they coax him, they right here. Life, the news view takes of me. Basement. Wanna leave the Congo? No, 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 no. Lock tight. Bingo, bango, bango. I'm so happy in the jungle. I refuse to go. I don't think I can pick this. Really sad that I had to kill everything.
here's a thing. A, a sort of a note, I guess. Um, this place would elicit fear in most individuals. You know, uh, Fortunately, my training prevents. Wait, what was that? Squatters. Own a piece of Diamond City history and then beat people to death with it. Sheldon Hellman wants this girl to crawl out through the fallout. Uh, but, I mean, if you cared so much, wouldn't he have been with her in the first place? Please remain calm if you are injured. Please stand. Please remain calm if you are injured. Burns away. How do the fall out, baby? Basement. Mm. Watch your step. Remain. Wait a minute. Not getting past me. Won't you crawl out through the fallout back to me? Ah, I messed it up a lot. Hate the ones with long pauses. I always mess those songs up. I hate long pauses. But I do love show tunes. Me right up to a cloud. A little atom bomb. I want her in my wigwam. She's just the way I want her to be. A million times hotter than TNT. Now bump, 
Piada, bom. Piada. These things are freaking heavy. Now that Dr. Lee's arrived, I'm certain she'll be vital to the Brotherhood's success. Actuators. Delivered and done. Nice work. Right on schedule. I've completed the restoration of Prime's basic functions and he's ready to go. In fact, it's getting difficult to explain to the system why it can't move right now. Well, as soon as my scribes get those actuators in place, we'll have his arms and legs installed in no time. Which brings me to your next assignment. It won't be long before Prime can walk and talk, but he's missing one last important element. His nukes. Without them, his offensive systems aren't operating at peak capacity. What's Prime armed with? Prime has two weapon systems, his eye laser and his nuke pack. The eye laser can target a hostile from hundreds of yards out and take it down with pinpoint accuracy. His nukes are modified Mark 28 nuclear bombs. They used to drop the things from bombers during the war. Just one of the nukes is equivalent to about three or four Fat Man shells. Basically, whatever it hits isn't getting up again. His eye laser is almost ready to go, but without nukes to load into his pack, he's fighting at less than half his capability. Shouldn't be a problem. Just tell me where they are. I wish I could. Prime's bomb pack is fitted for Mark 28 nuclear bombs. The same type of bombs that were dropped from aircraft during the Great War. The Commonwealth was a major staging area for the military's air force. So we assumed we wouldn't have trouble finding them. But since we arrived, <laughs> our scouting teams haven't located a single bomb. That's going to be a problem. Without a fully loaded nuke pack, Prime won't have the firepower to take on the Institute. Can I build the nukes like I built the actuators? I could build you a thousand nuke casings, right now. But we've got nothing to put inside them. The Mark 28s have a specialized nuclear payload that requires the correct balance of fissile materials in order for them to detonate properly. In other words, I'd love to mix you a cocktail, but I'm all out of liquor. But before you give up hope, there's actually a silver lining here. Proctor Quinlan has located some records regarding a military installation, which was used as a nuclear weapon. Sure. We're fairly certain this is the catch is that the installation is located I'll head out there immediately. Good, because that's exactly what we're asking you to do. Scribe Halen's established a communications point on the frontier of the Glowing Sea. I suggest you head out there first, and establish a signal protocol with her so that the nukes can be airlifted out once you've located them. Hopefully, by the time you've returned, we'll be ready to wake Prime up, and you can say hello. Good luck, Knight. That was Tex... 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 Beneke. Need to get out of this radiation now. So, uh, there's this thing I heard about. Uh, I'm not even really sure what to say. <laughs> there, there are stories about. I don't found it. Well, it was some contraption built out there in the common. No one has mentioned it. <laughs> they don't know what it does. Target it's eliminated. Not sure. Next part. Well, I mean, it's, it's, just, it's just people talking. No, it doesn't. It doesn't make it true. Not necessarily. But it's been said.
baby right behind you baby Good to see you again, Knight. You've come a long way since you stumbled into Cambridge Police Station. Thanks, Halen. We're doing the best that we can. We've had the occasional synth attack, but so far we've been able to keep them from overrunning us. Thanks to the reinforcements and the air support, I'd say that site was secure. That's not surprising. I appreciate that. Anyway, I know you don't have time for small talk, so I'll get right to it. I've had the men set up the equipment we'll need to pinpoint you once you've found the bombs. We've rigged up this distress pulser to emit a unique tone that we'll be listening for. When you find the bombs, plant the pulser, and we'll handle the rest. After that, you should probably head back to Proctor Ingram and bring her your report. Hello.
Fucking dance. Because I got dance, I can get some. Watch your radiation levels. My suit's meter is off the charts. You uh, enjoyed that song by. I don't think we're alone. Warren Smith. Fucking giant pyramid. Oh fuck.
visual on the target. Such a powerful mm -hmm. guy.
way safer to just uh, sit here and play. play. I... Why do these objects keep moving? That's how we do it in the Brotherhood. something excuse me paladin dance what do you want just wanted to check. i think we have the potential to be quite an effective team if you learn to cooperate that's all for now affirmative hmm
Man, I didn't have to look past that door. Wish I had. Feels like you can take on the world in there, doesn't it? Sir? This is Captain Mitch Dunleavy, 132nd Engineering Corps at Sentinel Site Prescott. All lines of communication are down, and we're That's tracking it. multiple inbounds on radar. This is a drill. We need confirmation May immediately. May Atom guide you, brother. Now that this site's been secured, you should return to the airport immediately. I'll remain on watch until the vertebrates arrive. Good idea. Wouldn't want these things falling into the wrong hands. Exactly. I'll meet you aboard the Pridwin as soon as these bombs are counted, tested, and loaded. Outstanding work, Knight. person that disobeyed Captain Kells ended up scraping rust off the Primwin's hull from the outside. Proctor Ingram? Looks like the Mark 28s are gonna do the trick. That was a good find. I'll work with your team to ensure that Prime's bombs remain stable after they're loaded into his pack. It won't be too much of a problem. Well, Dr. Lee, I have to admit, we couldn't have done this without you. <laughs> it's a little early to begin celebrating, Proctor Ingram. We haven't fully thrown the switch on Liberty Prime, and I'm just hoping all the work I've done to keep his system stable are gonna hold. I have full confidence in these- I appreciate that. Proctor, all the readouts look green. I think it's time for you to perform the power shunt. Twenty-eights are gonna do the trick. That was a good find. I'll work with your team to ensure that Prime's bombs remain stable after they're loaded into his pack. It won't be too much of a problem. Well, Dr. Lee, I have to admit, we couldn't have done this without you. It's a little early to begin celebrating, Proctor Ingram. We haven't fully thrown the switch on Liberty Prime, and I'm just hoping all the work I've done to keep the system stable are gonna hold. I have full I appreciate that. Proctor, all the readouts look green. 
I think it's actually, I think I'm gonna let you. After all, without your help, we'd still be. It would be better if a trained technician performed that task, but. run a basic diagnostic on him. Diagnostic command. Accepted. Give him a moment. He needs to adjust to his new configuration. Voice module. Online. Audio functionality test. Initialized. Designation. Liberty Prime. Mark II. Mission. The liberation of Anchorage, Alaska. Primary targets, any and all red Chinese invaders. Now let me run a system analysis and battle readiness check. Liberty Prime, full system analysis. All systems, nominal, weapons, hot. Warning, nuclear weapon payload depleted. Reload required. Warning. Power core offline. Running on external power only. Core restart. Recommended. Ability to repel red Chinese invaders. Compromised. I've got green lights across the board here. He's looking good from where I'm sitting. Doctor, if you wouldn't mind keeping an eye on the big guy here, I'd appreciate it. Well, I have to admit, wasn't sure we'd be able to pull it off, but pretty Prime's looking pretty good. What was that he said about his power core? Prime's in top shape, but his nuclear engine needs to be restarted. Right now, we have him running off of the Pridwin's engines. Once I get that sorted out, we'll send him off to kick in the Institute's front door. Before you head off to your next assignment, I have something for you. I came up with this little beauty myself. I think it'll add a bit more punch to your power arm. This one. Come on. Besides, Liberty Prime isn't about to run out and get you a gift. Anyway, that's enough of that. You better hightail it up. Elder Maxon said he needed to speak. And thank you, Knight. Without you, Knight. And that's what I want to happen. I become elder. Or dance does. Dance is gonna be elder. Excuse me, Elder Maxon. Is there anything you wish to tell me, Knight? Not at all. I find that very hard to... Proctor Quinlan completed the decryption of the data. Uh -huh. A portion of his findings included a list of synths that went missing or escaped from their underground facility. After careful analysis of the information, Paladin Dance is a perfect match for one of the synths on that list. That's impossible. I'm afraid not. The evidence, the data you brought back included a record of each subject's DNA. We keep the same information on file for all of our soldiers. Paladin Dance's DNA is a perfect match for a synth they called M797. To make matters worse, he's gone AWOL, disappeared without a trace. His sudden absence simply reinforces our conclusion that M797 and Paladin Dance are one and the same. I'm finding it difficult to believe that he never confided in you. Uh -huh. Apparently, I've misjudged, which means I've decided to take you. However, that doesn't... Dance is a synth. He represents everything. Our mission in the Commonwealth is clear. 
The Institute and its creations need to be destroyed, uh -huh. which leaves me facing the most difficult order I've ever given. I'm ordering you to hunt down Dance and execute him. Isn't there some other... Absolutely not. Listen, I'm not blind to the fact that Dance was your mentor. And this isn't... Mm -hmm. But if we're to remain strong, right. find Proctor Quinlan. He's been analyzing the data and should... Uh -huh. And Knight, there's a promotion for you riding on the result. You're dismissed. Are you serious? I have to kill Dance no matter... F what the bullshit. Attention. Bravo 6-4, report to Armor Bay 2. Bravo 6-4 to Armor Bay 2. Oh, Knight. I was told you were coming. Sorry about this business with Dance. What do you know about this situation? While I was decrypting all of the data you acquired from within the Institute, I came across a list. It appears that the Institute keeps exemplary records where their synths are concerned, including logging those that were reported missing. <sighs> As I was perusing this list, I came across an image of Dance under the heading M797. A quick DNA comparison with our own records told the rest of the tale. I'm certain this comes as quite a shock to you, Knight. I'm sorry. He'll be missed. Doubtful. I wouldn't miss a synth. Any... I was merely sorry that you... I've been poring over Dance's duty reports and unfortunate. Uh -huh. As you're well aware, Dance had intimate knowledge of the Commonwealth, and I'm afraid he could be seeking refuge. I think our best approach would be to identify every location he's ever visited and eliminate them as possibility. Uh -huh. You may want to get comfortable. This could take quite a bit of... What the hell is this crap about... I assume your outburst was a reference to some doubt regarding Dance's identity. I can... So he sets Dance up, and then you... Right. How did you hear about it? There are no secrets in the... Bro Maxon's made it clear that we're to locate Paladin Dance, and if we find him... That can only mean you've been sent to hunt him down. Orders are orders. Orders are orders? I can't believe that after everything Paladin... Dance There's obviously been a mistake, and we need... Scribe Halen! You're addressing a senior officer, and you will show him the respect that he's due. Now, unless you're here with information that can assist him... Of course. I believe I have some information... Very well, then. Would you care to enlighten us? Or do we have to wait until you decide to grace us? Knight, if you'd accompany me to the flight deck, I'd like to show you the... I've stored the data on my Vertiberg gunship... Uh -huh. Take anything that gets me closer to fight. Yes, sir. Proceed, Knight. I'll continue. If you'll follow me, sir. Well, if it isn't the man who revived Prime, the Brotherhood is in your debt. Now. It's definitely Max and who's this it? Bastard needs to die. Dance ran away. He must be guilty. We better find him before he reveals our secrets to the Institute. Where's the vertebrate? There's no vertebrates here. Oh, there it is. Halen? This way. Do you actually plan on killing Paladin Dance? 
it's a risky quest. I know it is, but I... I've known Paladin Dan. He trained me, showed me the ropes, and when I screwed up, uh -huh. he's earned my admiration. I don't care what Quinlan's report says. I don't care if he's a machine. That's a bold statement. It's more than just a statement. Uh -huh. Dance is the most selfless person I've ever met. I've watched him rip. That's why I'm asking you. Not just as a member of the Brotherhood, but as a human being. Give him a ch If you're not convinced by what he says, or somehow he's become truly lost to us. Sure. All right, I'll hear. That's all that I ask. I'll just have to trust that when the time... <sighs> Before the Pribwin showed up, Dance had me identify a fallback point if we ever lost the police station. It was Listening Post Bravo, <laughs> an old pre-war U.S. military outpost on the northern frontier of the Commonwealth. It's isolated, and we're the only ones that knew about it. So just be careful. There's no telling what state of mind he's in right now, or if he trusts... Carry food with uh, you or you'll end up eating some pretty questionable. I don't think any time has gone by long enough to find that humorous. settlement you sent me to help they've decided to join the Minutemen. that's great news i knew you were the right person for the job by the way you should have one of these flare guns you can use it to signal for help from any nearby Minutemen. it'll get more and more useful as we get more allied settlements eventually you'll have help wherever you need it. so there's something i need to ask you i guess you know i'm one of the last of the Minutemen. but i never really told you what happened to it I figured. Have you? What was it? I thought everyone were the minute men betrayed. I was with Colonel Hollis's group. A mercenary. We were the only one. Only a few of us got out alive. We never found a safe place to settle. As long. I'm not about to give up. That's why I'm talking to you. Uh huh. Hey. I appreciate that. Okay. I'll do it. Good. Don't worry, I'll be right beside you all the way. The leader of the mi our last leader was General Becker. The one good thing about me, now it's your job. I've got something a bit There we go. I'll sniper on here also. Tesla.
Hope this rain lets up soon. Baby, I'm never gonna get, get. 